Yeah. 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 Come on. Welcome. Good afternoon. Sean Higgs coming at you. It's midday money on Tuesday, the 9th of April. Welcome on into the show. Hope everybody's super duper at Mr. Sean Higgs in Twitter world. The X. Come uh, come say hello if you haven't followed me already there. And as always, you can listen in podcast form after the facts. Uh, Pandora, Spotify, our radio, Amazon, Google, Apple, wherever. Type in midday money, get midday money and late night money there. And the YouTube channels, Winning Free Picks and Sean Higgs. If you weren't on Sean Higgs, I came in halftime last night. We did a little uh, halftime stuff. I didn't end up having anything on halftime. We like the under. I gave that out on the pub show before the game. And then we went through all of the Major League Baseball for today. And we'll do that again shortly. Um, we'll tweet these out. We'll do a little recap and be on with our day. So recapping yesterday's action, let's uh, take a quick peek. Two and one in MLB. Cleveland run line, Nats run line, Braves run line, loser. And player prop eyes, we go one and one because we had a guy on a bench plus $85. There you go. Super duper. Let's tweet this out here and get to today's stuff here. Let's get to today's. I will again adjust my mices because I'm on the other computer screen. Ah. I need more sleep. I need more sleep with that. So um, today's action, it is in the Twitter world. I'm going to put it in the comments section as well for those watching in uh, Facebook, Sean Higgs, YouTube, Winning Free Picks, YouTube. And in the chat as well, here we go. 2017 plus 325 with our MLB picks. Again, 2 1 yesterday. Let's get it going. Early action here. Pirates run line plus 165. Again, these are from last night. Did the show last night. We said Pirates run line plus 165. Yankees run line plus a 115. In the Royals, you know we like Raggins on the hill, plus 110. No hockey, no NBA. Stay away from the NBA with a couple of games left here. I'm, yeah, if you're looking to bet, you want to go on a team who's got something to play for, maybe a better seed. You got Golden State's locked into a seed. The Lakers could get out of a play-in round that the NBA made specifically for the Lakers. I don't know why they'd want to get out of their specially made playoff round, but they, they possibly do. Um, no thank you. No thanks, no thanks, NBA, no betting allowed right now. You got to, you know, we got playoffs starting up a little bit. And hockey, I just didn't really look at. Winning record in both sports, 43 and 38 plus 335, 20 and 20 plus 50 on the ice. No thank you. Let's do some player props, though. Two and one, uh, one and one yesterday. We had the uh, Rocio did not play, plus $85 against 16 and 20 plus 620. That's how you get up because we're looking at one game today. It is the Yankee game I'm going to focus on here with Volpe and Cabrera. Volpe Ribby is a $2, 2 to 1, 154 a run. And Cabrera is a 240 Ribby and a 170 run. Um, Volpe leading the team in runs scored. Cabrera is second in runs scored. Cabrera is second in RBIs. Volpe is third in RBIs, tied for third. We'll get some opportunities a little further down in the lineup. Let's be honest. I could hit all four of these today, and we'll have a nice life. No, it's not a nice life. It'll be it'll be a good day. What's that? Four, five, six plus seven forty. That'll be a super Tuesday to say the least. When all four of these puppies cash. Player props for you. That's what I do. Um, hype note. I'll do my little tap thing if you want to get on board. Promo code midday. It's in the description. 
support the show. Like I know it's hard enough just hitting the like button, but if you want to get on board for a weekly pass, thirty-one twenty, you get all my plays. Uh, there is currently seven MLB winners up for tonight. Twenty-nine and twenty. We're sitting about a sixty percent clip on the season with our baseball. Not too bad. Let's see how the comments are going on a Tuesday afternoon. Hope everybody's with us and survived the eclipse. Let's see, Michael A. Higgy, good day to you, my friend. Same to you, Michael. Uh, what's good? We're gonna. Well, I just ran now. It's good. We're gonna sweep the Ribby Run Run Ribby Run Prop board today, and uh, have a great day of baseball. Uh, plus money. Marcos Minnes house hitting the like button for you, Miss Nick. Appreciate it. Let's. Here's a little Marcos Minnes for us. I did it real fast yesterday. I'll do it again. So we got the Pirates here in the chat. Obviously, we like the Orioles over the Red Sox. Cleveland would be another run line. White Sox look terrible. And Mike Soroka, as I said, 10 games in three years. No, thank you. I lean a little Reds action here with Frankie Montes. Uh, Yankees run line in the chat here, plus 115, plus the player props. Seattle, Toronto have no real lean on. Probably would think under in that game. I would still come back on a Braves run line off a loss. Team total, I probably should have took a, a – a team total. I don't know why I didn't. I apologize for that. Maybe I'll do that in my own personal life after the show. Uh, Dodgers run line for me here with Glass now in Minnesota. I just did a free pick with Ross and Jesse on this game. I mean, Minnesota, two runs, one runs, two runs, two runs, zero runs. There's a rare seven in there. Uh, I, I, the Dodgers are going to score their, their four-plus runs here. And, of course, you got your Mr. Numbers. Dodgers to send three and a half for more batters to the plate in first inning. It'll be minus 220-ish, 215 to 240. Who knows what it is? It'll be juiced. It is what it is. Uh, Houston and KC, Cole Raggins. We got him here in the chat. Phillies versus St. Louis. Uh, Sonny Gray, first start. No, thank you. I lean Phil's there. A's in Texas. You know I was sort of want to take the A's. I said that last night. Uh, Arizona and Colorado. The Gads. Um, had to work out for Zach Allen backers yesterday. Did he get the win? I think he got the first five. Tampa and the Angels, no thanks. The Natties and Kyle Harris. The Natties got it done for us yesterday. I know someone's going to say, wow, I can't, you know, the Nationals, there's no way they can beat the Giants. They did it again. Although today the run line in the National game, I believe, was in the 150 range, 145. So I'm going to have to say no to that. Uh, ben Brown getting a call here for the Cubbies versus Joe Musgrove. Padres would be the play after the Cubs blow an 8-0 lead for me. That's my Marcos minute for our guy, Marcos. I got my superpowers from the Eclipse essay, so from now on, call me the Black Superman, he says. <laughs> Bucks tonight on the Road Warriors. Uh, uh, Bucks tonight and the Road Warriors. Go Milwaukee, go. Golden State NBA Finals, here they come. Well, Black Superman, you must have not gotten uh, – you, you might be strong, but you have no brains here, Marcos. What do you do? Golden State. Golden State to the finals out of the play-in. They're the, the worst team in the West, the, the last team in to the finals. Max von Schlitt, nice Philly logo. I like the old baby blue Philly uniforms, Max. Punctuation goes a long way in these comments. Keep the show, Higgs. I listen every day. Uh, mostly on playback due to work, but thank you for effort. Yes, punctuation does help sometimes. Uh, spelling, although I do, I, I have a, I don't know, I guess from doing the show, Max, I, I could kind of decipher sometimes where we're going with games. Although there are times when we have different sports playing and somebody put one game, I don't know what's what we're talking about. But I appreciate you watching and that you get in live here today, which is great, and listen on the playback. Awesome. Leave a comment on a playback. I'll give you a little thumbs up and a heart sign. And uh, I do try to comment all the time, too. Michael, I said, Bracey total was five and a half last night. Never in doubt. I can't believe the Mets won. I can't stand the Mets. Uh, Michael, I took the Spankies. Team total four and a half day at home, riding the hot bats. Uh, you know, it's crazy. As much as they're hitting, you look at that lineup. Um, the, the, the lineup, I mean, judges in like under 200. They're getting done other, in other spots right now in that lineup. Uh, Bill says, good call on the Natties. I like them today as well. I do too. I, I don't hate them. Uh, you're going to you're gonna give us a, a big number here. First, the youngster, Harrison. I get a 150. Again, I didn't play it though, Bill, but I'm not against it. 
Lock it up. The king is in the house. Welcome. Max is definitely around the Yankees again. Two out to ignore. Yeah. Now, listen. Um, so you watch replays, Max. You know me. I, I'm not going to tell you to lay a 195 a $2, 205 So I do run line or a uh, no bottom nine. A first five, I guess, if it's like 130 140 Tim, how did everyone probably do this with the Braves money line? Asking for a friend. Tim pops in. Mr. Met himself. The Mets get their first win of the year. I know it wasn't their first win. I'm going to tease you a little bit. Forget about that one going down. Let's you. I mean, I guess that I guess that would would start the whole day for you because if you had that one, you know you had the Diamondbacks in there as well, and probably the Giants, right? So three huge faves all go all go down. Abel's in the hat. I didn't even Abel. I didn't even check my Facebook here. Hold on a second. Let me go up to the little like Facebook likes. Rick Wild, Abel, and Dennis O'Brien. My three-headed monster. I appreciate each and every one of you fellas for hitting the like button. Thank you. There's a Sean Higgs channel. If you haven't followed the Sean Higgs YouTube, please do. Um, I do some more live stuff on there because, you know, the P&P winning free picks, sometimes they, you know, too much live isn't good apparently for channels. But it's all right for a little channel like my Sean Higgs channel. So check it out. There's winning free picks. If you're on Twitter, again, a lot of Twitter comes across. So if you want to hit a YouTube channel, hit a like button. That's great. And if you're on Facebook, always hit a like. We got another Facebook like. Davis, my guy. We love when Davis comes in. He's going to give out a lot of games. And Davis does sometimes post on his Facebook page, Fade Higgy, Fade Jesse, however we're doing, he lets you know. And I, I do not mind. Lock it in with the king. 3-2 of baseball, take it, 17-7 start the season. Pick in the books. That's a, You got to cherry pick a little bit. But is that really cherry picking or 17-7? That's a, that's a nice – that's a good number. I've seen – I know guys who've got like seven or eight games this year in, in baseball. Michael B's in the house, right on point with his take the Nationals run line yesterday. Never in doubter. Nice night. Nats money line. Yep, Natty's running a half. Team total over. Snell under K's. 4 no sweep. I did lose Purdue first half at the last second. That was a tough way to go down Purdue first half. And that played like we thought it would, right? I mean, under uh, Purdue kept it close, and then you get that UConn run was going to come. I mean, Purdue just could not get a three off, could not take a three. But, yep. Pan says, wild day yesterday. Got lucky. Pan, it was somewhat first fast. Which Cabrera? Miguel Cabrera. We like Miguel Cabrera to have a day here for the Yankees. Uh, that would be the only Cabrera on the Yankees. I thought, isn't there only one Os- Oswaldo Cabrera? Do they got a second Cabrera on the Yanks? It does say New York Yankees, Volpe and Cabrera. Maybe I'll take the little dashes out. Maybe I'll take the dashes out confusing people. Unless there's another Cabrera. I could be wrong. I do not know. There, there could very well be a second Cabrera playing for the Yanks who bats. I just did not know that. But we'll adjust it. We're all good. Miz is in the house. First five Dodgers minus half. Yankees first five minus half. Arizona first five minus half. Atlanta over nine and a half. And the Braves run line. What could possibly go wrong with taking the Dodgers as a road fave, the Yankees as a big fave, Arizona as a road fave, and Atlanta as a big fave? I'm sure this is a perfect sweep of the board, Miz. And I say that knowing full well that one of these things is going to lose. Hopefully it's not the Yankees' run line because we have it here in the chat. Or the Dodgers because we have a Dodger run line play for myself. Pat says, Phillies first five. Rangers run in half. Fade in wood. Soraka under two and a half Ks. He's terrible. Cleveland, third best team that doesn't K. Yankees and Dodgers three ways. See, the fade wood I understand, but I don't like the – you have Texas off of the big series versus Houston – Getting and getting beat up the last two games. So close loss and then get beat up last night. And Evaldi's, I mean, I like Evaldi. So run line would be the way to go, I guess. But again, I, I sort of lean a little lazier because I'm a sick SOB. The mine's coming with the Cleveland Guardians run line. Sure. Right? It's Soroka. No thank you. Diamondbacks run line in the over. You think it, it's a payback game. You lost yesterday. They get it done again. They get it done here today. I get it. 
Uh, Dodgers, I like. I did a little free pick on that with Ross and Jesse. And the Braves to rebound against the Mets. I don't hate them. Pat says, Cubbies plus a half first five yesterday, leading 8 nothing, lose 9-8. Oosh. The Natties yesterday, San Fran over four and a half catches with seven runs. Yeah, Nationals, Nationals, Nationals. Pound Sports says, D-backs are on the do not bet list unless it's first five. Their pen has now lost five games this year. Yeah, that's first five only. I mean, blew another one. Player preps, I'm not mad about Snell not going over here. He threw 72 pitches in three innings. Win, lose, or tie. I'll still back my hand. Snell just don't have command on the pitch. I wonder why he didn't have command player prop. And we, we said this yesterday. And, and and Michael B. pointed it out. No spring training, no rehab assignment, just coming in cold. And Jesse Shule rolled out today that Snell, the last two years, go look at Snell and starts the last two years. Last year, 0-5 with like a 5 ERA. The year before that, 0-5 with like a 6 ERA. He's terrible out of the gate. He's terrible out of the gate. Don't, don't fall for Snell early in the season. Go click on his game locks from last year. I'll be sure to not take Snell his next game. Player prop says college baseball, Georgia money line, and Illinois plus one fifteen parlay. Max is coming. Dodgers team total over four and a half minus one thirty at DK. Yes. Listen, if you're if they're giving you less than five and a halves, I, you just got to take the Dodgers. Um, it didn't get there the other day. I understand. That's fine, but still, take the four and a half. I mean, Mr. Numbers will tell you they're going to play four guys in the first inning, probably score a run. Player Prop King says college baseball Miami and Utah plus 140 in a parlay. King D says appreciate it. Yeah. Listen, I'm going to give you a prop 17 to 7 a nice little run. Take it. Marco says thank you for the Marcos minute. You got it, my fella. Uh, Nerfy Boston Baltimore minus 130. I don't know about that. I don't know, man. I think they're going to hit Bellow. And I like Bella. Nerf for Toronto, Seattle, absolutely. Two guys aren't hitting, and I think two pitchers who could rebound here. Melky, that's right. Oh, Melky's still playing, right? Melky Cabrera? <laughs> Melky Cabrera. Uh, baseball Nerfy, Philly, St. Louis. I don't hate this with Wheeler and Sonny Gray. Now, I don't like Sonny Gray because he's come back off an injury, but he could get through an inning. The Phillies aren't hitting. Davis is in the house. It's NC State in college baseball today, minus a 166. Robert Dix is in the house. It's pit with a 13-point drop on the line. The – is this pit baseball or pit hockey? Pit hockey. I guess it, baseball, so it's down. What is this? Basically a pick up now? For this matchup? I don't know. I'm, I'm still seeing 125s. I see a 125, I see a 120, a 123. I mean, it's open at FanDuel open at a 115, Caesars at 125. I mean, Bet365 had a had a 130. I mean, DraftKings open at 125, it's at 122. Don't know where that line came in. That's a that's a late late move. Somebody pitching change late. I'm just saying, two to one with the A's. I, the, again, it's just I didn't bet it, Ant. I'm just saying I got I got the Rangers off of a Houston series where they lost the last two games, where you thought they're going to go in and they win the first two. Then they're facing a guy who's coming off a, a, a no hitter. You think they could win that game just on a basis guy through no hitter? Except they got no hit for seven and two thirds innings. You lost that, and then you got smacked around yesterday. So I just don't like the spot. I'm not betting the A's. Were you upset with me taking the snow over? I was worried about the snow over. I told you how I felt about the snow over. Because you were like, oh, oh, who did the Nats have? 
doesn't make a difference. You got to look at everything else that's included in that. Where you got a guy who hasn't pitched in a game or even a sequence. So, yeah, he's going to throw a bunch of pitches because he hasn't had a batter in a batter's box since last September. Michael B., I'm with you on the Royals and a letdown spot for the Strohs of taking the O's in the bounce back. Sox coming home off a long road trip. Yes. Agreed. Max says, last before you, Higgs. Yankees team total. Yes, over. Bait. Marlins have been setting a new low. Bunch. Of... Marlins are terrible. And I like the Marlins. I got a, I got a Marlins over ticket somewhere. That's probably next to the shredder in the garbage can. Because uh, I like their pitching. I thought maybe you'd get some hitting. They, they're doing nothing right now. Absolutely nothing. So you want to go over? I don't hate it. Again, you got to fade a team. They're playing this bad. I'm not saying take money lines minus $2. You want to run line them? Even money minus 110s. Team total here. They should score some runs. Absolutely. Absolutely. You have to. If it loses, so be it. You should have been cashing on this last couple of days anyway. Michael B. NBA. I know you don't want to bet it, but I got the Thunder minus three. Warriors plus two and a half, Heat minus two and a half. So I think Jesse had the Warriors today in the free pick show we did. I actually said to take the uh, Sacramento Kings. Now, you got a three. I, I got a five and a half this morning. So, um, and the Heat, not much thinking about the Heat game here. All teams have player spots. See, but the Thunder one, though, they're not playing SGA or the other guy. So, they could lose and still be a three seed. They're the three seed right now. They're going to be the three seed. They're not going to rush SGA back to maybe win some games. And the Kings are battling because they're a game ahead of the Lakers for the play-in spot. Like, they're they're in the bottom. They don't want to go to a play-in game. Give me the points. Warriors, again, how do you like the Warriors? What are they playing for? To what? Maybe leapfrog the Lakers to be the nine seed instead of the ten seed? They have no they're they're in a the playoff spot. They have no reason to play. They're, they're the last team in the playoffs. I'm against you on two of those. Uh tomorrow says NCA baseball. Just what we need, Tim, because Davis was in here taking NC State. So what do we got today? Coastal. That is player Pop King's favorite team. Coastal plus one thirty. Wilmington plus one thirty. Everything in the uh Carolina backyard for, for Mr. Earl. Missouri State minus one fifteen. The Shockers at plus one twenty. NC plus 120, Texas State plus 140. Bet some dogs in midweek games. There you go. Yes, because you were annoyed that a team was losing their midweek game. So now it's time to fade them. Michael Amato says, I hopped on Dodgers team total four and a half as well today with a full nine at B's. Yes, worth it. Sunday Gray, 65 pitch count tonight. Not No SP for Gray. Yeah, he's on a pitch count. How I, Again, that's 65. You're getting back at the form. He could be on the fourth inning, right? He comes in with three walks, three strikeouts. Sayonara, you're out of there. Michael A. says, so I got Spanky's team to over four and a half. Yes, Dodgers team to over four and a half. What could go wrong? Uh, listen, I like both of them. Dodgers are going to score four or five runs again. That's what they've been doing. So you're alive there. And the Yankees, let's see. I don't know. I mean, Puck. He was supposed to be awesome, hurt, reliever, back to the starting role. He's been walking guys. And Yanks got some guys who walk now. So Yanks should, I mean, both of those should get there. Player Prop King says, I look as you as someone I could trust in betting. I apologize for not listening, but I was of snow when he was in Tampa Bay. I get liking snow in Tampa Bay. I get liking snow when he was in San Diego. I don't mind liking snow, period. But you have to look at the, the situation of that spot for him yesterday. The guy had not pitched against a live batter since September 25th of last year. Wow. Oh. It's over. Listen, we're all going to lose a game that we, we like, so it's it's not a big deal, player. I was just letting you know, like my side, I was trying to – I like the Guardians. Run line one and a half, absolutely. Soroka, again, 10 starts in three years. No, thank you. He has not been good. And, again, I don't like – if it was – one thing if I was just – not like lecturing, but giving my point on game that I we were I was on the other side, so I was clearly thinking that I, I bet my own money. Said no, I, we got to go the other way here. When you dig into it, a lot of times we go through the games. I don't have anything. I tell you, I sort of like this. I sort. I'm not trying to talk. If you're betting it. You bet it. But if I bet something the other way, I'm going to tell you why I like the other way. 
Player prop. I love Coastal Carolina. That is your squad player prop. We got to change your name to Prop Carolina. Carolina Coastal Carolina King. Michael B says, Warriors can still climb into the AT. The Kings are going to lose to the Thunder, and if the Warriors win tonight, they can get home court for a 9-10 game. Now, uh, they're going to climb into the eight seed. I mean, if you're thinking that route, why can't they? They could. Why can't they climb into the to the six seed? Because they're only a game. That's a, it's only one more game to Phoenix. So you're telling me that Golden State's just going to run the table out of here? You're beating the Lakers, Portland, New Orleans, and Utah. I mean, all pretty winnable games. Two two on a road to you know. You know, New Orleans is going to say, "Hey, we're already locked in a spot. We'll mail it in." Is that what New Orleans is going to do? No, no reason for them to to win a game. Your this is your fandom coming out here, Michael. This is your fandom coming out. Don't do it. Davis says Florida State minus one fifty today, and also on Golden State. I mean. You're you on home court and you have a losing record at home. Warriors have a losing record at home. Groovy, our first basket master. Next bowl game, Io Dusuma, eight to one odds. First basket thunder, the giddy plus fifty five zero. Well, five five zero. Not fifty five zero. Oh boy, what's happening here? King D says, White Sox Guardians first five under four and a half. See, I would say yes to that, but why do I think the Guardians could hit Soroka? And again, Cleveland is a team I want to bet unders on because I like their pitching staff. I don't like their offense. But Soroka, I do not like one bit. Michael B says, we'll see. I'm not going over the top, but I bet it. I'll be here tomorrow. I know you'll be here tomorrow. Again, I didn't bet the Lakers. It's just, I I don't know. Uh, To me, the, the Lakers are in a spot to maybe want to win out. They're in, a, they're in a better spot to win out, I should say, right? Or when I say win out, I mean to adjust their playoff seat. They're a half a game behind Sacramento as opposed to two full games behind Sacramento. See, I really want the Lakers and Warriors in the playing game. Two trash teams deserve to be in a playing game. If we could somehow get the Suns in there, it'd be a round robin of the best players in a league in a round robin game, which would be fabulous for the NBA. You have KD, Steph, and LeBron all in a play in. Player prop says, I'm out of here. I got to go back to work. Day trading. He's day trading, folks. There we go. Good luck today. Pat says, Snow was a huge fade yesterday. Player prop, just like Gray said. Yeah, Gray's the same, same spot. Toronto pitcher got destroyed last game. Bassett did get destroyed last game, but overall, he's a solid kind of pitcher. But. What has Seattle done lately? I mean, Kirby hasn't been good. Do you want to bet the over with these two? I, I had the I had the under yesterday with these two clubs because they're not hitting. And I have two pitchers who, as Kirby's short track record and Bassett track record, say they're a lot better than what they've been. So I'll and I have teams not hitting. I'm gonna uh, I'll go to the pitchers before I go to the hitters. Tarp says I look at the Grays under K's. Yes, Snow was a coming out and look at Cy Young for him. He starts slow last two years. Look at his numbers, Bandit. And look him up. Jesse brought him up today on the show we did on um, on, on the PMP channel, me, him, and Ross, the wise guy th- show we do. Terrible the last two years out of the gate. Fade him in April. Player prop. Outlier had him going over 60 and a half at 70% line. Well, again, I don't. you're going to rely on somebody else. Um, you got to take into consideration the guy has not pitched. October, November, December, January, February, March. Now it's April. Six and a half months has not faced a live batter. I don't know. The last two years, he's 0 11 with like a six and a half ERA in April. But somehow, Outliers got all the information for you. Gators stink, lost the worst team in the SEC, Mizzou, says Davis. Players is just sad. Listen, don't. You're a day trader. You like betting player props. You're gonna get sad if you lost something. Come on, man. You don't get sad. This is why you can't. You win, you lose, you move on. Let's go. Get sad. You get sad. That guy's not putting food on your table. He doesn't care. 
It's making $33 million this year. Michael B., I do think the kid Harrison pitches well for the Giants tonight, but I don't want to bet the Giants as a big favor. I agree. I like Harrison. I'm all for young guys. You know, Mike, you watch the Sean Higgs. We do baseball cards. I'm all for young guys. I, I love it. My my uh, MLB 2024 team, I'm trading away Judge. I trade Soto. I trade, I trade everybody. Cole, I just try to get a whole team of under 25 guys. And I know Soto's young, but he's contracts too much. So I like Harrison, a lefty. Groovy says, Arsenal, soccer, both teams to score on the pitch. Hawes in the house. Took the Braves' run line tonight and hoping they don't drop two in a row to the Mets team. I agree. I like the Braves' run line tonight as well. Braves' run line, Braves' team total. Fade the Mets. We're not late. Not not Mets fans in this chat, except for Tim Earl. My old cohort. He'd pop in. Not anymore. He doesn't like me anymore. Kitty says, later, brother. Best of luck tonight. You as well, Kitty. I'll see you later. Michael B. says, speaking of young baseball players, I got some wander cards for sale. Any takers? I got to go to my joint. I got to see what my guy will give me for a stack of wanders with a couple graded. I got wander graded. I got wander uniform patches, number to wanders. All absolutely worthless. I'm going to see if I can get like a 87 box of tops for him. That's what I'm going to I'm holding out. I'm going to hold out for some 87. Groovy says, first basket, the Heat game, DeWante Murray, 9-1. to one. So Giddy, Murray, and some dude's name I couldn't pronounce for first baskets today. David says, the Indianapolis Indians, minus 135 at 635 today. We're going Triple A baseball? Is that what this is? Triple A baseball? Davis? Davis, what do you know about Triple A baseball? Who's on who's on this team? Who's on this team? If they had any hitters, you'd think that the Cleveland would bring them up. Why wouldn't Cleveland bring up anybody if they're these got guys who could hit? Uh let me see. I got triple A on my site, I think. Um, let's see. Minor league baseball. Indianapolis are playing the Toledo Mud Hens. Favored. Interesting. <laughs> Michael B says, I mean, you can't see Wanda right now. You'll not get anything. He'll be back at some point. Don't sell right now. Ah, Got 70 cards. Why not? Why can't you sell him? He's coming back. How's he coming back? But Trevor Bauer's not coming back. This guy's stuff's a lot worse. Trevor was never charged with anything. This guy's got charged. Patton says, I'm with you, King D. Um, Eileen Cleveland over. This is great. This is this is a speak to test right here. This is a speak to chat here. I'm with you, King D. Eileen Cleveland over as they're going to put the ball and not strike out. I'm not a Logan Allen fan. His ERA is misleading. Uh, I see. I like Logan Allen. Michael B says, I think it's about time to own some of my Kuna cards. I need Alonzo to get traded so I can sell some of his. It's time to buy football cards. I got an 89 box of Topps trade to Mike. I don't know. I I um, I put a picture on Twitter yesterday to like card purchaser. I brought an 89 box. And it's got the Aikman rookie in there, Dion's in there, uh, Derek Thomas, Barry Sanders. There's like a Herschel Walker in there. It's a great one. Sean Landetta. I think there's a Gary Hogaboom card. Super duper cards. They were like, fill me on it from like the chalk. They were so fresh. Groovy says, points bets ban me last year for winning too much on baseball. New company bought them out and registered. They said no. <laughs> points bet. Yeah. That, that, I was on that for about a month and a half before I got out of there. <laughs> it was, it's points bet. But how Markel's in the house. Wander Mania. I can't. Yeah, I found it. Wander Mania. It's right up there with Brian De La Cruz Mania and uh, Eli De La, I meant Eli De La Cruz Mania, not Brian. That's 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 your guy down in Miami. But yeah. Oh, Eli De La Cruz. Oh my goodness. Who's it? Jackson Merrill. Money line, Markel says, I'm on a Braves team total over. Sure, Dodgers team total over. What could possibly go wrong with all these faves? Orioles run line, Guardians first five against Soroka. Uh, Pat says, he's supposed to be back 
So Mike's right. I heard that too. He's out until June-ish. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. I have... Ugh. What are we going to do with those Wanders? David says, Norfolk Tides. Why is what 70? Minor league baseball action. Triple A baseball betting, a true degenerate betting. Loving it. You should do your live degenerate show. Should I do a live show tonight at like 6 o'clock with Triple A Triple A teams? I'm going to, we'll do it. I'll bring out like little Bowman baseball cards. We'll dance around like. Um, I, I can't even think of a name off the top of my head. It's supposed to be good. <laughs> Tamir Johnson for the Pirates. Triple A is up to the bat. Michael B. I think I want to invest some Drake London rookies. I like having a bid year with Kirk Cousins. Yeah. What could possibly go wrong with Kirk Cousins? Guy's 40, coming off an ACL injury. Hasn't won a playoff game in 40 years. They're going to be good. I want that, I want that total to keep going up because I'm taking a I'm taking a Falcon under and I'm rolling right back on Tampa Bay. Let's go, Tampa. Everybody loves the Falcons. Bowers blacklisted. Yeah, I know. Totally banned. Totally banned. Got got text text a girl saying, I like this, 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 and this. The other guy's like, I know this is wrong, but I'm gonna give your mom a car so she could sell you to me. <laughs> Sorry, I don't uh and listen, who knows? Everything's gotta come out, right? Everybody's had people pegged for things happening. We don't know. He's still in limbo. Terrible if it's true. Stop Geo's in the house. I don't need the Falcons to do anything. I just need London to put up numbers. Yeah. Who's he putting up numbers with when Cousins gets hurt with his with his bum foot? Here comes Desmond Ritter. Save the day. There's no Marcus Mariota. Let Mariota walk. I can't believe... We're going to go on a little football rant. The the lack of quarterbacks in the NFL. It is, you got Mahomes, and it's everybody else. Like, all right, Rodgers has come back. The guy's 40. Burrow gets injured. Josh Allen, whatever you think of him. You like Tua. Hurts. They're the young guns. Herbert for... Uh, the Chargers. What else do you have here? Dak. People don't like Dak. People think Dak's garbage. I'm a Cousins guy. Puts up the puts up a bunch of stats. Who else is good in this league quarterback list? How many bad quarterbacks are there? How many? I mean, you got Goff. People like Goff. Purdy. Stats Padford. I mean, Stats Padford, Goff, Carr. Um, Rodgers, all late side careers. I mean, Dak's going to get 50, 60 million. These young quarterbacks, nobody's getting a shot. Strata is a great season. Jordan Love, is he the real deal? Let's see what they are in here. I mean, I I, I kind of like Love more than I like Strata. It's crazy. People will be like, you're nuts. It's been in the system for five years. They're going to draft these quarterbacks thinking they have some kind of hero. Kirk Cousins is 35. 35 coming off an ACL. I don't like it. Tons of mediocre worst QBs. Yeah. I mean, the money is the money. That's the going rate. It is what it is. That's why you can't blame the Texans for going out and get, um, what's his name, from, from Buffalo. Diggs, right? Diggs is over there. Because now you're in a spot where you got to pay Dak Prescott 50 mil. I, let him go. Bye, Dak. I mean, Trey, I, I'm, I, I, I remember two years ago, people were betting Trey Lance to win the MVP as a rookie. You didn't even take a snap. Derek Carr. Exactly. I mean, it, it, like Garoppolo, you have guys, 
people are like, oh, these guys are terrible. They're better than some other guys, but it's, it is, you have a couple good guys, a couple guys people sort of like, but say they're not good, like your Dax and your Goffs and your Staffords, who Kirk Cousins said. And then there's a whole pile of, well, maybe we'll see. We'll, we'll see. Again, we saw a golden age of quarterbacks in the 80s, 90s, 2000s, early 2000s. I mean, even the 80s when it was more of a, you know, three yards cloud of dust, we're going to run the ball, pass the ball. You still had your Marinos and your Steve Youngs, Joe Montanas, Elways. You had guys, um, I mean, heck, I don't know, put like Joe Theismann in there. He was in super awesome. And then you had your the two thousand. That's like probably your glory years, right? You had Brady, Manning, Drew Brees, just one after another. Roethlisberger, just awesome quarterbacks. Detroit Lions curse host the NFL draft. Uh, is it a curse they lost last year? I think that's a curse. Niners are a good team. Good team. All right, uh, Pirates. Run line, that's already off the board. We got action in that game going. Yankees run line, Royals money line, our guy, Cy Young Cole Raggins. No hockey, no NBA. We're having a winning season. I'm not going to put something out for a video. I, so I know people look for free picks. I, I tend to try to give a game out that I bet on or I at least really, really like and want to bet on. Prop-wise, nice start, plus 620. Yankees, Volpe run and a ribby. Cabrera, Run, and Ribby, both Yankee players. Both play for the New York Yankees. One is the league leader in runs, the team leader in runs in Volpe. The other guy's number two in runs in Cabrera. Ribbies, Volpe, number two team in Ribbies. Cabrera, number three on the team in Ribbies. Nice big payday. Nice big payday on our way here for our player props. One nothing. The Detroit Lennies take a lead. That's fine. I like it, Rob. You know why? Because now the Pirates got to score. They can't win one nothing. It's like we got to get runs across the board because Detroit could hit. So, good. 6-2 win incoming. I'll be back for late night Monday tonight. If you want to stop in, we will look into the Wednesday ticket of Major League Baseball. We got two 1 o'clock games tomorrow. Two, three 3 o'clockers. Well, 3.45er. So, day action tomorrow. Day action. Love it. We love it. I'll see everybody tonight. Thank you for popping in. If you haven't already, hit the like button. Uh, the two YouTube channels, Sean Higgs, one of your picks. Come over if you're on Twitter watching. Like both of them. I don't know. See you tonight.